Brave has become the first major web browser to natively support the IPFS protocol. What is that? Well, if you're in a place where you might want to access censored content on occasion, you need to get schooled about IPFS, quoting ZDNet. Released in 2015, IPFS stands for Interplanetary File System. It is a classic peer-to-peer protocol similar to BitTorrent and designed to work as a decentralized storage system. IPFS allows users to host content distributed across hundreds or thousands of systems, which can be public IPFS gateways or private IPFS nodes. Users who want to access any of this content must enter a URL in the form of IPFS. Under normal circumstances, users would download this content from the nearest nodes or gateways rather than a central server. However, this only works if users have installed an IPFS desktop app or browser extension. Brave says that with version 1.19, users will be able to access URLs that start with IPFS colon forward slash forward slash directly from the browser with no extension needed, and that Brave will natively support IPFS links going forward. Since some major websites like Wikipedia have IPFS versions, users in oppressive countries can now use Brave's new IPFS support to go around national firewalls and access content that may be blocked inside their country for political reasons and is available via IPFS. In addition, Brave also says that its users can also install their own IPFS node with one click with version 1.19 and help contribute to hosting some of the content they download to view." End quote. So you might remember when I decided to abandon ship on Chrome last year and you all convinced me to give Brave a try. A year on, I continue to be thrilled with that decision, all the goodness of Chrome without all the badness, and now all this added goodness as well. 